Hey everyone, I'm Bworks, and this is a quick tutorial video on how to set up my upgraded dorm room inventions. Um, there's four of them as of right now. I'll pick the standard one for this video, and I will cover some other features that are coming out eventually, like the environments for the outside in other videos, but this is just a quick video showing how to set up the upgraded dorm rooms so that you can have it as neat and as flush as possible, and uh, basically allow you to have more space in your dorm room. So this is all built above the standard dorm room. This is the skylight and uh, it just allows you to have more room. I know lots of people have their uh, their spawn now in their clubhouse and they do that for more space but this allows you to have your, uh, your spawn in your dorm room still with having a lot more space. So without further ado I will get to the setup. Um, just for the sake of the video I'm gonna delete everything. Obviously you don't have to do that, but um, just for the sake of the video, I'll do that. So I'll pick the standard dorm or the standard upgraded dorm to start. Um, basically, if you're on VR, just hold your pen straight forward like this and spawn it in. This will select the entire invention. So when you have this, the best way to do it is to not use the arrows, but to go to like any side of the um, top of the skylight here, which I call the trophy case. And just basically you got to move it to the top of the skylight here. There's only one way it can go. If it's the wrong way, it's going to be obvious and it won't fit. This is the correct way. As you can see, it's fitting pretty nicely. Um, if it's the other way, you're going to notice it not flush at all. You see how it's just not even close. So I just undid that. Um, at this point, just... Uh, Line it up as good as you can. This is an important step because um, it's going to have to align with uh, the dorm downstairs, and I'll show that coming up. So, this looks good to me. Um, as you can see, this is all your space. There's a bathroom and a bedroom, and if you're on PC, this can be covered up with whatever you want, but only PC players can see that, I believe. Um, so, this right here leads into your mirror, like your... Um, closet I like to call it. So I'm not going to go through that trigger zone because that'll bring me down there and I'm holding this entire thing. So I'm just going to go to the top of the skylight, go down to here, and just check to see if everything's good. So as you can see, I didn't set it up correctly. This is not, um, it's covering the backboard. So I'm just going to do that. Um, before you let go of your pen, just make sure everything's good. Um, just check everything. This is the most important step is making sure this part's good because this is where it's going to start clipping with stuff that's part of the original dorm room. Um, but when you're happy with it, which I think I'm happy with this, you just got to drop your maker pen and it's all here. So add whatever you want to this. Um, obviously, you can't edit this object, um, but you can just add whatever you want. Start your own stuff. Um, in my dorm, I have the hot tub here. I actually have hot tubs in my invention store if you're interested in buying some. Uh, it's up to you, but add whatever you want. You have all the space to work with. Keep in mind, if you fly outside here, you're going to respawn. Same with up here. And the reason you hear two respawns is because whenever you respawn, you respawn back to your original dorm. That's just how it works. So I have a trigger zone here set up so that if you end up going into the place you can't enter, like the outside area, it puts you in here and then it puts you back up to your dorm. So that's why this is there, so that it just, you know, ends up putting you up here. Um, every light switch works. Uh, there's three of them. So you can always just change the, the lighting. It's up to you. Do you want it brighter or darker? But yeah, that's that's basically it. Um, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments. I will reply to all of them. Um, I want to make sure you guys are happy with this. And on that note, thanks for watching.